hey, do we have a friend on this planet? That's a good question. Um, we do. Oh. Oh. Oh, hello. Oh, it's an ocean player. Yes. Okay. Oh. Oh. Oh, that is gorgeous. And we like being above the water. Yeah. Scabro. Oh! Nice, it's you. Good to see you made it here in one piece. The first solo launch is a doozy, isn't it? Uh, so hey, don't freak out or anything, but I... Lately I keep, like, dying repeatedly. Oh! I don't know, it's pretty weird. Oh! What, what about me? Have you died lately, or is it just me? Uh, no, it's me too. We're in a time loop. Time has been behaving unusually lately. Yeah, a time loop makes sense. Cool. You're taking this pretty well. <laughs> right back at you. Personally, I like new experiences, and I've never been in a time loop before. I mean, I don't think I've ever been in a time loop before this one. Looks like you and I are the only ones who can tell that time's gone all weird. I tried radioing Hornfells and asked if they'd died too, but they thought I was being metaphorical. Mm. Even if I tell Hornfells about the time loop, they never remember by the next one. They don't realize anything's different. And here's another weird thing for you. Every time I die, all of my memories from that loop replay back to me. I'm pretty sure that's related to this big stone Nomai statue I found on one of the other islands. I was looking at it, and the statue opened its eyes and started glowing. They replayed my memories like it had seen them through my own eyes just like what happens each time I die. Well, that happened to me with the statue at the museum. You too, huh? Then the Nomai statues must have something to do with why we're the only ones who are aware of the time loop. So, no glowing statue, no time loop awareness? I think that's going to be my leading theory. But if you find anything new about the statues or the time loop, let me know, okay? I'll be here. Anyway, that's what's new with me. But hey, this is your first solo voyage. Kind of. Let's talk about you, you know? How's space treating you? What are you doing out here? Well, what are any of us doing here, really? No, I'm just kidding. I'm out here exploring our solar system, same as you. But I tell you what, outer space really gives you room to think. It's quiet and peaceful out here. I mean, it's usually quiet and peaceful. Sometimes a cyclone comes by and lifts my little island paradise clean out of the water. Then less peaceful. How's space treating you? Uh, where should I explore on Giant's Deep? Here's something you might like. At the start of every time loop, I keep seeing a bright flash in the sky at the start of every loop. Something must be happening up there in the orbit around the planet. What else? What else? Uh, have you been to Statue Island? That's what I've been calling it, seeing as it's the island where I found the glowing Nomai statue. Get it? I was on the beach on Statue Island when the whole glowy business happened, by the way. It's a nice beach for that sort of thing. I give it a solid 7 out of 10 on the Gabber relaxation scale. Hmm. Feel like checking out Statue Island? It's the one with two islands connected by a natural rock arch. Well, mostly connected anyway. You'll see. How's space treating you? What's up with this planet? What's the deal? Haha, <laughs> I know, right? Oh, you meant, like, tell you more about it? No, I gotcha. Well, Giant Steep is ma massive and mostly water. No surprises there. There's a strong current a ways beneath the surface that prevents anything from sinking below it. Seriously, I tried everything I could think of to get past that current, and neither idea worked. As for land masses, I've counted four islands, including this one. There's also the one with that Nomai statue I saw on the beach. You've seen the cyclones? Yeah, they're hard to miss. 
They toss up everything in their path, items included. A little tip, if you get picked up, try to land in water. Less likely to kill you. How is space treating you? Where's your ship? That's a good question. It's definitely on this planet somewhere. I mean, unless a cyclone came by and tossed it into space, I guess. <laughs> That'd be pretty nuts. Hope it's not lonely. Have you ever watched a cyclone for so long it started to hypnotize you? I'm telling you, they'll put you in a trance long if you stare at them long enough. How's space treating you? Uh, have we found anything? Nice night, what you got for me? I found the source of the time loop. Wait, whoa, really? The Nomai carved out the Ash Twin and built a time loop device inside? That is wild. Now we know what's causing the loop then. And if it's caused by a device, that must mean it had to be switched on, right? Huh. Hey, what do you think would happen if you turned off the time loop? Like, there's a part of me that thinks maybe you shouldn't, what with the sun blowing up and all. Yeah. Then again, who wants to spend eternity being blown up by the sun? I don't know, I'm no time loop expert. I'm just gonna sit here and ponder the intricacies of time and space. And maybe take a nap too if I feel like it. Have you ever watched a cyclone for so long? I'm just gonna I do this one. I found all my masks inside the Ash Twin Project. Hey, you did find those. You're saying the statues were made so memories could be sent back in time? I guess that makes sense considering we both have our memories of every loop we've gone through. Wait. Then it's just our memories being sent back in time to us, right? Then, are we really experiencing multiple time loops or not? That's pretty deep. Like, maybe our consciousnesses have been through all these loops, but maybe our bodies haven't, because technically the loops never happened. Meaning we're receiving memories of things that will never happen to us. Cool, huh? That's all. Uh-oh. Oh, oh. Don't want to go in there. This is spooky. The this is spooky goes. mess. It's two time grab. Oh. This is heavy, Doc. Y yep. Statue Island. Orbital Flash. Ocean Depths. I think we gotta find the Statue Island. I, I wanna find Statue Island. Hey there, son. You're looking ready to explode. Yeah. Oh, hello. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh yeah, sun's definitely getting ready to explode. Oh, we were probably sucked up by a cyclone. Oh, okay. I think so. Oh, there we go. Speed run. Woo! Oh, that's a place to land the ship. So it'll yeah. stay put. Oh. But sun's about to explode. So well, we'll go and see what happens. Sun is currently exploding. Oh, use jetpack booster. That'll get you there. You fell in the water. I did fall in the water because the gravity is super high. Okay. That's fair. That's fair. Just waiting for the sun to uh, catch up. Yep. It is very dark because the sun is gone. But now the sun will be everywhere. That's not how it works. Oh, 
Beans. Now you will be the sun. <gasps> I guess. That's just science. Yeah.